Sony Music is a big music publisher. Very big, in fact. One of the biggest. They have thousands of writers signed to the publishing companies they own. Sony Music is also a big record label. Very big, in fact. One of the biggest. They have thousands of performers and producers signed to the recording companies they own. So you would think that Sony would be one of the strongest advocates for fair payment to writers, performers, and producers, especially from the interactive streaming companies that are making billions off our music. But you'd be wrong about that. Instead of fighting for higher rates for writers and publishers, Sony's label has joined up with the interactive streaming companies to try to hold royalty rates down. Yep, you heard that right. The Sony label is in a legal proceeding to try to keep the royalty rates for interactive streaming below their real value. Why would they do that, you might ask? Well, that's a great question, and not one that Sony has really answered yet. The best guess is that Sony thinks that if writers and publishers get more, giant record labels, like Sony, might get less. And since Sony's profits from recordings are higher than their profits from publishing, the more money that comes to the recording side, the better for the Sony labels. Now let's be clear. We think recording artists and musicians deserve every penny they get. But we also think writers and their publishers deserve to be paid fairly, and right now they're not. The problem is not that any music creator is getting too much. It's that the interactive streaming companies are paying too little. And we believe that has to change, starting with the current legal proceeding. The Copyright Royalty Board, or CRB, sets the rates for physical downloads and CDs, known as mechanical royalties, and for interactive streaming. The proceeding to determine a new rate will start this fall, and sadly, Sony will be joining the interactive streaming companies in opposing a reasonable rate increase. That is, unless Sony hears from enough members of the music community, writers and publishers, but performers and producers too. So we, all writers, performers, and producers, need to send a loud and clear message to Sony that they should be with music creators, not against us. Tell Sony Music to join the rest of the music community in supporting an increase in interactive streaming rates. Thank you.